Governor Mark Dayton says he'd veto a bill that would kickstart construction of a crude oil pipeline replacement across northern Minnesota. The years-long review process for the Enbridge Line 3 pipeline is nearing its conclusion. The Public Utilities Commission approved the final environmental review of the pipeline replacement earlier this month. But House Republicans say approval of the energy company's project hasn't come fast enough. A House committee passed a bill Tuesday night that would authorize construction immediately. It could come up for a final vote in the coming weeks. Dayton promised on Wednesday that he would veto that legislation. He calls it a politically motivated bill that would trample the state's regulatory process. I will oppose anything that will compromise, or in this case, destroy the, that integrity of the Public Utilities Commission and that review process. And this one is just, just ridiculous. I mean, just to say, we're going to, the legislature is going to take it over and just say Enbridge can do whatever they want and it's approved. I mean, I mean that's, that's, that doesn't take us back to the 20th century. That takes us back to the 19th century. The Public Utilities Commission is set to decide on approving the project in June. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.